today we are going to take a look at how to use parameters in a BDD scenario. Let's go! I'm using Squish for Java, JavaScript and the JavaFX address book example application. But BDD in general and also the following feature is available for all Squish editions and script languages. I have prepared a little test which just creates a new address book and a person as you can see here. But all values are hard coded. I would like to change that. But first, run the script. I would like to start with a feature file now, which is this one. In particular, the then step here needs some modification. The data that we would like to hand over to the steps needs to be entered here with single quotes and separated via commata. Looks like this. Now back to the steps. At first, the sentence that I modified before needs to know what kind of parameters we have. It is a word, an integer or something else. The change has to apply it also here. At first, there was the name Kevin, so it's a word. Then we have his last name, which is also a word. An email is defi defi an email is def an email address is defined as any, and the phone number is just an integer. To use their data, some variables needs to be defined. They might look like this. The last step is to replace the current hard-coded data to the just-defined variables. And now everything should be ready to go. Let's replay the script again. We just get rid of the hard-coded data. Don't forget to check out next week's video where I'm going to show you how to share data between steps. Thanks for watching. If you have further questions, get in touch with us by writing an email to squish at froglogic.com. You can check out Squish on your own by requesting a free trial. You might also be interested in our second product, Coco, which is a multi-language code coverage tool. Don't forget to check out our YouTube channel for more videos. Bye bye!